Hey everyone, hope you're good. Welcome to day 23 of our month of prayer and we're going to be focusing on our Sheffield campus and the verses for today comes from Ezekiel 37 in the Old Testament, some famous verses. It's beginning with verse 3, it says this, Then he, that's God, he asked me, Son of man, can these bones become living people again? O sovereign Lord, I replied, only you know uh, the answer to that. Then he said to me, speak a prophetic message to these dry bones and say, dry bones, hear the word of the Lord. This is what the sovereign Lord says. Look, I'm going to put breath into you and make you live again. Now, just a little bit of an update from us. We've now been living in Sheffield for almost seven months. And from the beginning of February, we've launched our weekly Sunday services in a city centre uh, hotel. And uh, the miracle in motion that is Audacious Church, our church, can, uh, truly continues here in South Yorkshire. And we're just so thankful to God for all he's doing and the beautiful community of people that he is really bringing together to establish our church in this city. Now, over this month of prayer, we're really hungry and our desire is just to create greater space to hear, to listen to God's voice and hear what he's saying to us. Because we know that his word is powerful, that it, uh, when God speaks and we hear his word, it stirs, it ignites faith uh, and it unlocks the supernatural. And like Ezekiel, we want to hear what God is saying and then align ourselves with it and prophesy it over our city and over our people uh, in, in the preparation and the lead up to moving to Sheffield just almost a year ago now I was meeting with a local church pastor here in in Sheffield and he was talking about how um, when he was moving he had heard about um, some kind of statistics many years ago of how Sheffield and this region really was amongst the highest in non-church attenders for our country and even across Europe and something in him and really when I heard that again something in me kicked of uh of uh of man we've got to be here and uh there's so much work to be done but really again our, our response is sheffield hear the word of the lord that we're coming with faith uh we want to prophesy the we want to prophesy a revival a god pouring out his spirit and breathing into spiritually dead people that they would come and find home in our church we want to prophesy uh new life we want to prophesy salvation we want to prophesy freedom restoration healing and again people coming into our church and and coming to know jesus and finding home so today would you stand with us would you prophesy would you pray would you stand in faith for our city here in sheffield and our church being established right now really really exciting times we uh we're praying for a wave of new Christians, a wave of people coming to Jesus. Uh, secondly, this month, again, we're praying for prodigals to come home. Uh, thirdly, we're praying for just an acceleration of people coming to find home in our church, uh, depth of relationship being formed, an acceleration of people coming to join team, joining our small groups, and again, our church being established here. And uh, thank you for your prayers. Thank you for your encouragement. Today, let's pray over our city. Uh, Sheffield, hear the word of the Lord and believing that, again, the spirit of God will breathe into what looks dead and bring it back to life again. Thanks so much. Uh, have a great day. We'll see you soon. Much love.